Hey guys, this is Teddy. I still can't believe uh, at the end of the first half of this opening, I pulled an ultra rare beast ring. That's amazing. It's a beautiful card. It's a very sought after card. I looked it up and it's going for like $60 already. So that's pretty wild. So that's pretty cool. Let's just start it with the other half because I think it's going to be just as good. I hope it's just as good as the first half. All the excitement's got me a little gassy, so you might hear me burping. I'm sorry about that. But I just can't contain my excitement. My body knows I'm excited. So, here's an Esper, an Execute, a Scatterbug, a Hone Edge, a Helioptile, a Reverse Hollow Scatterbug. <gasps> Ooh, we got a four. Our first four of this set is a Yvelo GX. Look at that. That is a nice card. Oh my gosh. And it's, it's, uh, people have been panning it. It says it's not very good uh, for competitive reasons. But it is a beautiful card for my collection. I'm very excited to have that. I'm going to put it in a sleeve because it is a full art. And it deserves to be treated with respect. Oh my gosh, guys. These are some good pulls. It's back to back. Beast Ring is that now Evital? Or Evital? <clears throat> That's amazing. Let's get this guy. Protected, okay, let's put him in some protection. Then I'm gonna put him in the top of the sheet because this card is also very pretty, very well centered. Um, so this print is looking much better than some of the previous prints of uh, uh, past. You know, some of them were pretty poor, but uh, this one's looking very good. Let's move, let's put it right by the behind B string. How is that? Oh, geez, okay. So you can see the beauty of it. That's crazy. Okie dokie. So let's keep going. Uh, I forgot where it was. Oh, Fighting Energy. A Tyrant. Ultra Recon Squad. And an Amora. So that's pretty cool. Okie dokie. Sorry, I'm getting these things all organized down here. Oh, you can't see them. I moved them back down so you can see all the really good stuff up there. Okay, dokie. We got our second pack of this side. This side started off really good. Let's see if we can keep it going. Here's a Froakie, a Helioptile, a Pan Sam, a Bird's Mice, a Scatterbug, a Reverse Fur Fru, and then a Sylveon Non Hollow, a Metal Energies, one of my favorite energies, a Crasher Wake, Azelf, and also a Recon Squad. So that's pretty cool. And this goes there, okay. Gotta get used to where I moved him to now, okay. <clears throat> okay, now we got Greninja. That'd be cool to pull a Greninja in this box. That'd be very cool. Let's see here. We have a Flabebe, a Gibble, a Kalanser, a Noibat, a Pan Sham, a Reverse Hollow Rare Barbarical. So that's pretty cool. We pulled the regular version earlier. Here's a Meow Stick. He's all curled up by the window. Like a good boy or girl. So what's this Pokemon going your bench Pokemon? That's pretty cool. And then a Dark Energy, a Dew Blade, a Judge, and an Azelf. So that's pretty cool. Let's see here. There's that, that, and that, and these. Okay, perfect. Alrighty then. That's Ace Ventura, I would say. Here's another for the night pack. So far, so good, guys. I think this box has definitely been pretty awesome so far. Here's a Binnacle, a Rock Ruff, a Jibble, a Flabba Bay with evolutionary advances. I didn't talk about this when we saw him before, but if you go second, this Pokemon can evolve during your first turn. Which means if you have a rare candy and uh, I can't remember the floor just. You can evolve it in that turn to stage two on your first turn. That's crazy. A Skiddo, a Snover, Rich Hollow, a Rare, is a Clawster. There's a Fire Energy, guys. Forget about Clawster. Let's take a look at that Fire Energy. Looking uh, very good. Add that one to the collection back here. Look, they're starting to get so many of them that they're going behind Snorlax. We're going to have to make a pile of them or something and you keep a counter going. Here's a unit energy, a Yuxi, and a Foy Pole. So that's pretty cool. 
and then I think I don't have the Forbidden Lights online yet, but I'm still going to give away one code because uh, I think that you guys uh, deserve to have some of the fun too opening the packs when they come out uh, soon. So I would just make sure, you know, sharing is caring and I care, so I share. And I want you guys to make sure to share too. Don't take all the codes. Let some other people have some. Here's our next pack. Okay, okay, let's see what we get. Here's a rock rough. A Skrell, a oops, excuse me, <laughs> a Skrell Gunk, a Froakie, a Reverse Hollow Rare Magnus Zone, Lightning type. So that's pretty cool. Same ability as Ultra Prism, except for now it's Lightning Energy, except instead of Metal Energies. Our rare is a Buzz Ball Ultra Beast. Oh, that's pretty cool, guys. Look at that. So this is a baby Buzz Ball. It's only got 130 HP. It's still Ultra Beast. And it's got the attack sledgehammer for one fighting energy that is 30 plus if your opponent has exactly four prize cards remaining this attack is 90 more damage that's a lot of damage for one energy so if you get a buzzy wall knocked out you're on one turn and you get this guy out there he's going to be swinging for 120 damage and if you put a strong energy on there that's 140 damage and if you put a toy spin on there that's 170 damage from a baby buzz wall that's pretty crazy so, and if you keep him at four prizes by not giving up any more Pokemon, then you can do that all game. That's crazy. And then, oh, that's gross. Get that out of here. That's a fairy energy. A Gavite. A Hoopa is eating a bunch of round food because it likes uh, hoops and round things. Hyperspace Ring. Touch your deck for up to two item cards. Reveal them and put them into your hand and shuffle your deck. That's pretty, pretty good. It gathers things it likes and passes them through its loop to teleport them to a secret place. So it's, I would call its mouth its loop and it's secretly teleporting all those things to its stomach. And then there's Crasher Wake. So that's cool. Okay, okay, let's put him up here to see why I like him. So well, that's pretty cool. Rick Hollow Rare. It's always nice. You get two rares in one pack. Okie dokie, let's see what we got in this one here. Okie dokie. We've got a Skrelp, a Furfru, a Lit Leo, a Fennekin, a Clauncher, a Reverse Hollow Frogazier, that's pretty nice. Our rare is a Torterra Fighting type, same as the Grass one, just a fighting now. A Lightning Energy, a Zygarde, a Haluta, and an Amora, so that's pretty cool. Okay, Here's another one. Of course, we got a few more. We hopefully get some more great pulls. Although, so far, the pulls have been a pretty a great so far. Magnemite, a Cubone, a Bonnelby, a Snover, a Scatterbug. <gasps> Ooh, a Reverse Hollow Guard Stomp. We pulled a Hollow in the first video. Go back and watch that one to see it, what it looks like. But we got a Reverse one now, so we now have two Fighting Type Guard Stomps. That's great. And then our rare is a Pavilion, which is very good in the pre-release. If you play the pre-release, you know how dangerous this card is. But it's probably not going to see much play uh, in regular. And then a Grass Energy to go with it. A Frog Deer, a Spoopa, and a Klefki. So that's pretty cool. Okay, looky. Trying to get these all organized. Keep them all organized off camera. So here we go. We got your packs. Okie dokie, we've got a Bunnelby, a Honez, an Execute, a Yoibat, a Magnemite. Ooh, a Reverse Hollow Rare Florgis. I was just talking about Florgis. And you can evolve turn one uh, if you go second to this with a rare candy. Once during your turn, you may flip a coin if heads put an item card from your discard pile on top of your deck. So that's pretty good, especially if you have a, a draw mill, like a, uh, if you use Zoroark or something, you can just put whatever cards you want from your discard on top of your deck and then grab it. That's pretty good. And then Mistguard does 70 damage to prevent all damage done to this Pokemon from attacks by Dragon Pokemon during your next turn. So that's pretty cool. A Fermosa is our rare, it's a hollow rare Ultra Beast. That's pretty cool. This is like baby Fermosa, uh, because it's not a GX Fermosa. 
and it's just high jump six for colorless for 20 and white ray does 90 plus if you only have one price star remaining it attack does 90 more damage for three energy so that could be hard to use but i still a very cool card uh this is one of the promos but i had different art and i don't have that one i want that one real bad here's a water energy and a border a javite and a slugu so that is pretty cool put the hollow guy up there so you guys can keep looking at him Okie dokie. We're almost there, guys. Hopefully we get some more GX Pokemon. We've got three GX Pokemon and one Ultra Secret Rare Beast Ring, which is amazing. A Zupider, a Fennekin, a Geoptile, a Flavibe, a Binacle, a Reverse Hollow Zygarde. A uh, Rare is an Alolan Executor. That's very cool. This is one of the cards that's used in the uh, starter decks, a scene deck for this set. So that's cool. A Psychic Energy, a Bonnie, a Magneton, and a Slegu. There we go. Okie dokie, here we go. Alrighty then, we start with a Scatterbug, a Gibble, a Rockruff, a Clauncher, a Honez, a Jupiter, Reverse Rare, a reverse hollow, I'm sorry, it's not a rare, Dream Fighter is never rare. A Dragalgy, a Fighting Energy, Metal Frying Pan, a Bonnie, and a Magneton. Woo, Earthquake. So that's pretty cool. Put those there, put that there, put that there. So that's uh, pretty cool. Okay, okay, let's see how many we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight packs left. So there's still plenty of good stuff hopefully left for us, right? And here's a Noibat, and a Magnemite, and a Shrelp, and a Furfru, and a Litleo, and a Reverse Hollow Overwrest. That's very cool. We got the Hollow Rare earlier. And our rare for this set is a Full or Ultra Recon Squad. Oh my gosh, that's really cool, guys. Like, she looks so happy, and he looks like whatever. Uh, but that is so cool. Draw up to two or discard up to two Ultra Beast cards from your hands. Draw three cards for each card you discard this way. Oh my gosh, guys, we got two rares in this pack, and the second one is a full art trainer, and we've got a full art beast ring. Oh my gosh, guys, this has been a really good box. Oh my gosh, let me put this. Let me put this in a sleeve and put it in a top lower because it is a good card, and it looks like it's very nicely. Uh, centered and all the edges look good. Oh my gosh guys. What a box. This has been a great box. Oh my gosh. What a box There's never been a box like me. Oh My gosh That was the genie from the Aladdin. You never had a friend like me But this is a box instead. We never had a box like me So look at that also recon squad. This is what they would call a jank pool. We can put them back in front of the fire energies because that's pretty amazing. Let's move the visual back there too. Let's move this highway. Okay, there we go. That way you can see both of them. You can still see the beast screen is prominently on Snorlax's tummy. Oh my gosh, guys, I told you there's gonna be more good cards. So now we've got two GXs, uh, full art GX, Ultra Recon Squad full art, and a beast screen secret rare. Oh, so everything else is just like icing on the top of the cake. Or a cherry on top of a sundae. So here we go. We got a Shrelp, a Burzmite, a Froki, a Scroll Junk, an Execute, a Reverse Hollow Infernate Fighting Type, which is uh, the same as Ultra Prism, except for now it's a Fighting Type, which is weird because it puts 6 damage counters instead of 2 on your opponent's burned Pokemon. And it's a Fighting Type, so that's kind of weird. And then, oh my gosh, guys, we got 2 rares. And you got two Infernates, one Hollow, one Reverse Hollow. That's great for my collection. Wow, that's amazing, guys. Hold on. Oh, I never went through these other cards. I'll go through them after the rest of this pack. Hold on. And a Dark Energy, a Lazy, a Brexton, and a Mysterious Treasure. So that's a pretty cool. Mysterious Treasure is always nice to find. And let's go through the rest of these here. This is from the Ultra Recon Squad pack we got. Oh, that's gross. I shouldn't even brush that up. A Joe Blade. A Ziggersby and a Heliolisk. And here you go. Sharing is sharing. 
this has been such a great box. I have to share some of these codes with you guys. Make sure uh, everyone gets a chance to get it. Don't take most of those codes for yourself. Don't be greedy, please. Let everyone else have some fun. Um, so that's amazing. So amazing so far, so good, guys. Should we pull another GX card or another four? I don't know. This is really pushing my luck to think so. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay. So we got a Krogunk, an Esper, a Bunnelby, a Hone Edge, a Execute, a Brixen. <sighs> and so we got a Zygarde. We did get another GX, guys. We got three GXs in this box. One full art GX, one full art trainer, and one secret rare trainer. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. Look at that Zygarde. So, Zygarde's a Verdict DX is 150 damage and prevents all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks on your poke opponents. Pokemon GX and EX during your next turn. And then if you use Bonnie, let me grab Bonnie real quick. Let's see, there she is. If you use Bonnie, you discard that state if there you can only use it if there's a stadium card in play, and you discard the stadium card during this turn, you have Zygarde GX, you can use it GX attack even if you used it already. So you can keep using Inverted GX as long as you use Bonnie and have a stadium card to discard. That's amazing. That's amazing. Crazy. I pulled one in the three extra packs I got for the, the pre-release. But it's always good to have two and I can make a set and make a deck out of them. Here's Psychic Energy, a Vrakeson, Fossil Excavation Map, and a Baby Zygarde. A Puppy Zygarde is what it is. Oh my gosh, guys, what a box. Leave leave a comment down below telling me how lucky I am and how much you wish you were me right now. Because I bet most of you wish you, you had this box instead of the box you got, if you got a box, even. Oh my gosh, guys, what a box. What a box. So here is a Cubone, a Snover, a Bunnelby, a Gumi, a Binacle, uh, reverse is a rare Pangoro, that's pretty nice, reverse rare, so two rares in this box, another Zygarde, non hollow, Grass Energy, Floet, Heliolus, and a Diggers Bee. So that is pretty nice. Reverse hollow rares are always nice to find, so uh, cool to get. And we have four more of those, we have one of each art. Yes, we do. We got one of each art. Tell me which art you think is your favorite. And if you leave comments down below, tell me which art you think is your favorite. I'll randomly pick somebody and I'll send you a code card from this set so you can have it. So I'll make it random. I'll give it a couple of days and then I will choose and send uh, have you send an email. You have to so comment down below. Which art is your favorite art? Tell me down below. Okay, okay. So here's our Nagan Nadel. And it starts with a Gumi, a Snover, a Gumi again, a Cubone, a Froki, a Reverse Hollow Ruckruff, and then we got the Hollow Rare Trainer, Diantha. So this is new again from, I think, uh, the Black and White in the Plasma sets. We haven't had the Hollow Trainer that was rare. So this is pretty cool. You can play this card only if one of your fairy Pokemon was knocked out during your opponent's last turn. Put two cards from your discard pile into your hand. So you can put the Pokemon that just got knocked out back into your hand. That'd be pretty cool. But it's fairy types. And I don't like fairy types. Uh, so I'm going to just put him up here with the butt as well. And then a Metal Energy is one of my favorite energies. A Poipol. A Halusa. And a Unit Energy. So that's a pretty cool. Okay, three more. Let's see if we can get another Prism Star. I think anything else would be too much to ask. Oh my gosh. Don't adjust your TV. That was just me and my camera getting knocked around. Sorry. Sorry about that. So we have a Litleo, a Furfu, an Inche, a Magnemite, a Hoenn Edge, a Reverse Hollow Fennekin. Our rare is a Rotom. So that's pretty cool. It's a psychic version of the electric one from earlier, so that's cool. Water energy, go goes, unidentified fossil, not identified, it's unidentified. And a mesprit. <coughs> so this has been pretty cool. Okay, sorry, doing some pack organization back here. Two more. Oh, we're so close to done. 
Hopefully something good in these last packs. Last pack magic would be amazing. Let's see here. We got a bird mice, a skillo, a Jupiter, a scatterbug, ink. <gasps> we got the Diancy guy, Diancy Prism Star. This is a really good card. Princess Tears. As long as this Pokemon is on your bench, you're fighting Pokemon attacks you 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. So that's really good with Zygarde or Buzzwalls. And then Diamond Rain does 90 damage, deals 30 damage from each of your bench Pokemon. But it takes 3 energy, that's a lot of energy, so that's only got 120 HP. So that is a really good Prism Star to pull. We got 3 really good Prism Stars. Oh, that's pretty cool. Let's put them right there, can you see them? Yeah, you can see them. Let's do this, because Arceus. Old news, we got Diancy now, so that's pretty cool. And then we have an Abominable Snow is our rare, non hollow. Lightning Energy, and Air Force, Iraq Winnage, and then Ultra Space Stadium. So that's a pretty cool. Okay, so the last pack. Let's hope for some last pack magic. Get on the Ultra Rare train. Choo choo! Ultra Rare Express I brought it to us the Beast Ring. And this is the last pack of the other side. So let's see if we can't get something else. We got two Beast Rings. How crazy would that be? That would be insane. So let's open it up and see. Should we look at the back of the code card? No, let's not ruin the surprise. Let's see. It's a Gumi, a Jupiter, a Flabebe, an Esper, a Fennekin, a Reverse Hollow Fossil Excavation Map. Our rare is a Toxic Croak. Oh, but we got the Fire Energy. That is it, guys. Oh, my gosh. Ultra Rare Train Hype. Toot, toot, toot. Uh, it's not ultra rare, but it's a fire energy, which is even better. Get that fire going, throw the fire on the coals, get the ultra rare train going at full speed. So, that's a great way to end the packs. A fossil excavation map, a light standard lab, and a Dene. So, guys, what a pack. What a box. I mean, come on. You can't get much better than what I got here. So, put this fire energy back with the other fire energies. I'm going to have to count those up. Put them in a pile and keep a running counter in the background. But man, would you look at these pulls? I got a beast ring. I got two beast rings, but one of them is much prettier than the other one. I got a Yevatol GX full art. It's very nice. I got the Ultra Recon Squad full art trainer supporter. So that's very cool. I got a Zygarde GX regular art. It's got 200 HP. I never noticed that. 200 HP is very good for a base Pokemon. You put a Fighting Fury Belt on that and then he's got 240. That's insane. That's insane. Here's a Naganazel GX which is used with the Ultra Beast with his Beast Raid attacks. Then we've got Dialga GX which is our first GX we pulled. It's a metal type from the Ultra Prism. So overall, our really good pulls were really good. Let's put the big screen back down. So, oh my gosh, look at that. That's really good. Six hits. One, two, three, four, four five, six. <clears throat> six hits in this box is really good. Three regular arts, and then three of the crazy stuff in the back there. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I got that. That's amazing. So. So that's pretty amazing. We got the baby buzz wall too. We got Diantha, the hollow rare trainer supporter. And we got three prism stars. We got Diancy, we got Arceus or Arceus prism star. And we got Lysander prism star. So all those are pretty cool. This is good for Dikubulu. I mean, you might be able to show him in there. They call it Kikubulu now because you don't use a bridge at the beginning. It's the guy who came up with it. His last name is Kiku or something. And then Diancy should be coming in on the Buzzwall deck. You can only have one of them in your deck. So I only need one. But if I get another one, I'll put it into my collection. Then I'll eventually make a collection video. Because uh, now i got Beast Ring in there. So it's going to be really cool. And uh, then let's take a look at the Hollow Rage as well. Because we got lots of those. Lots of these as well. Look at all those. Aurora. We got the two fossil Pokemon. Tyrantrum and Aurorus. We got the Pyroar. We got the two Pokemon that have trainers with them in the background. 
So that's very cool, the champions. We got a Ultra Beast Hollow Rare, and we got an Infernape. This is a different typing. So that's all very cool, like that. So tell me down below which pack art you think is the best pack art, and I'll enter you in to get uh, a code to use in the online game. And um, guys, I can't believe we pulled all this good stuff, especially this guy. Oh my gosh. So anyway, let me know what you think down below. Follow, subscribe, whatever. Uh, you know, I'm on Instagram. It's, it's the same it's like Teddy216 Pokefan. Uh, there's no Teddy Ursa in this set, but that's going to be okay because we got a beast ring. So, whew. All right, guys. I will. I can't even put it down. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.